And happening tonight in Pawtucket, City Council expected to discuss buying alternative buildings all while the City Hall building undergoes repairs. City says those repairs could cost almost $15 million. Kristen Burnell looking ahead to tonight's meeting for us this morning. The city says they are looking at four separate buildings in Pawtucket for a temporary city hall, including two locations on Fright Street, one on Sabin Street and one on Cottage Street. City officials say the 88 year old city hall needs extensive repairs, but some city councilors have questioned whether spending the money would be worth it. The mayor spoke with 12 News last week about some of the issues the building has dealt with recently. He says some of the biggest problems include frequent leaks in the historic tower, tower when it rains, mold, air quality issues, and problems with the elevator in the building. Uh, council is uh, looking at get, looking at leasing and purchasing another facility temporarily. So by the end of the month, we'll know if we get their approval because they control uh, you know the city properties. So we'll know by the end of the month on what we're doing. But right now, we're just trying to make it day to day and and pray for no rain. Tonight's meeting is scheduled to begin at 7 and depending on if the elevator is working, it will be held in the city council chambers. But if the elevator is not working, the meeting will take place in the basement of City Hall. Reporting live at studio, Kristen Burnell, 12 News.